Hey guys, welcome to another Reaper blog tutorial. In this video, we're talking about grid sizes and how to quickly change them. So in this project, I have my grid set to one bar. So if I zoom in here, my snap to grid settings are limited to one bar. So if I want to edit here, I need to either change my grid setting or I need to turn off snap to grid. So if I turn it off, I can click anywhere. If I turn this on, I'm limited to where the grid lines are. I think everyone understands that. So let's talk about how we change the grid sizes. So we can right click on either the snap button or the uh, grid button. Brings up this window here. Show grid toggles the grid on and off and the line spacing, we can set this to any value we want here. From 1 28th up to four bars. And we've got triplets in there as well. So if I set this to eighth, you can see it instantly changed to an eighth note grid. Okay, so that's snap to grid settings, and this is great. It's a great handy set of functions there in one window, but I don't like having to go up to here and then back, and if that was the wrong grid setting, then I have to do it again and again and again. And this window keeps snapping over to that one spot, which is a little annoying. What I like to do instead is to use toolbar buttons to set my grid. So I've got buttons here at the top, four, two, one, half, quarter note, eighth note, sixteenth note, thirty-second note, and then I can modify any of these grid settings to be a dotted or to be a triplet. If my project calls for eighth note triplets, two clicks, done. Uh, so that's what I like to do, and here's how to set it up. I'm going to customize my toolbar so you can see what's going on here. And this is the section for those actions. I'm going to click on add and the actions we're looking for are set grid. And then you choose whichever ones you want here, set grid to one to half. And if you want triplets in your toolbar, you can just choose these from here. So set grid to one eighth, 16th. So I just use the basic ones here, set to one, set to half, set to quarter, set to eighth, set to 16th and 32nd. I never ever use 64. I also have set to two and four bars. And then the other actions are the toggle, toggle dotted grid and toggle triplet grid. I've had some people asking about this and so finally got around to making the video on it. Hope you've enjoyed this video. Thanks a lot for watching. Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Follow me on Facebook and Twitter. Support the Reaper blog through Patreon and visit reaperblog.net for a lot more tutorials.